square root of 98 times square root of 8. How to multiply radicals? When a under square root is multiplied to b under square root, we can write it as a times b under square root. So, this also we can write 98 times 8 under square root. Now, we can break down this 98 into factors. If we factorize 98, 98 is divisible by 2 because we have 8 at the end. 8 is an even number and any number which has even number at its unit place, that number is divisible by 2. So, we start with 2. So, 2 times 49 is 98. Now, 49 is square of 7. So, 7 times 7 is 49 and now 7 is a prime number, 2 is a prime number. So, 2 times 7 square, these are the prime factors of 98. So, we can write here 2 times 7 square, then 8 is 2 raised to the power 3 under square root. Now, 2 raised to the power 3, we can also write it as 2 raised to the power 2 plus 1 and a raised to the power m plus n, then that means a raised to the power m times a raised to the power n. So, 2 raised to the power 2 plus 1, this can be written as 2 raised to the power 2 times 2. So, this is equal to 8. Now, 2 times 2, this is 2 square, then 7 square, then 2 square under square root. When a raised to the power m times b raised to the power m times c raised to the power m, this we can write it as a times b times c whole raised to the power m. So, this we can write 2 times 7 times 2 whole raised to the power 2 under square root. Now, we can remove this square root with the square because square root means it is raised to the power of 1 upon 2 and then that means that it is multiplied to this exponent 2 times 1 upon 2 and here you can cancel this 2 and this 2. So, answer is 28. So, this is one method that you can multiply the radicals. Another method is that you can simplify the radicals first and then multiply them. So, square root of 98, we can write it 49 times 2 under square root and square root of 8, we can write 2 square times 2. Now, 49 is 7 square, so we can write here 7 square. Now, this we can write 7 square under square root times square root of 2 then times square root of 2 square times square root of 2. Now, remove square root with this square here. So, this is 7 times 2 and this square root times this square root 2 is square root of 2 square and here you can again remove the square root. So, it is equal to 28. How did you solve this question? Let me know in the comment section. Like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.